I was going to, I heard a theory the other day that I was going to share with you, Dan, that I thought was interesting about uh, people were talking about uh, how everybody talks about like the, for me, you know, the nineties were the best. And uh, for you, you probably thought like the seventies were the best years of your life or things should have been that way. Eighties, maybe. I don't know. I think, I think ni- early nineties were pretty good for me. Oh, okay. Never I had to grow up a little bit too. Yeah. I was pretty wild when I was young. <laughs> you, 70s you just, were pretty good but i think the 80s i kind of uh yeah kind of, um probably could have been more adult um so gotcha early 90s anyway. were pretty good to me there well you know how people always talk about like things were better back in the day you know how everybody says that yep. mm-hmm. and uh i heard a, a philosopher say that it's not that things were better it's just everything's better when you're young like everybody just wants to be young again, so That's it's like true. not nece- not necessarily everything is uh, is better now than it was back then. It's just that you were younger and and you felt better and things were fun. <laughs> I just wanted I want to hear what you thought about that. Not that, that has anything to do. I kind of agree with that. I mean, uh, there's there's a lot of things that uh, that uh, um, I've recently come to to realize were uh, were worse when I was young than they are now but other people don't talk that way. Kind of like, um, um, violence. Um, in my days, we were in high school, man, kids would get beat half to death. I mean, kids would end up in the hospital from getting beat up and stuff. And, uh, all, all that would happen is somebody gets suspended for three days, you know? Um, but I mean, people would have to get their noses rebuilt. I remember one kid getting uh, punched and, uh, uh, the kid put a finger right through his mouth, (laughs) through, through his cheek, you know? And, uh, um, every now and then somebody get killed and stuff. And, and that doesn't happen nowadays. These kids are pretty sheltered in, in school, you know, um, in outside of school, that's not to say there ain't violence now, but it's different. Yeah. Uh, you know, so yeah, uh, there, there's a lot of things that are worse now. There's a lot of things that are, sure. that are better now. Uh, it's, it's a give and take. Right. Right. Yeah. There's, there's definitely more consequences now. Like you, you can't get away with as much stuff as you used to be able to. Yeah. Um, yeah. I know I, uh, my uncle who's in his, I think he's close to 70 now and he wouldn't care if I said this, but he got, uh, he got caught when he was in high school, like still in a police car <laughs> and like didn't get in trouble. You know, it's like, like it was, uh, his dad was his buddy's dad was on the police force or something. And they, they stole the keys and, uh, you know, drove drove around or something. I don't know pull people over and stuff in it and you know now like if you did something like that now whew, that wouldn't be good um especially with social media and whatnot but uh, ah, there there could be an argument about some some people just need to be punched in the face too you know right um that's one of the things that did change for the for the worse when yeah. I was a kid I mean if you uh you had something to say say about somebody it was somebody in your world real close by. And if you said something, you, there was consequences. You know, nowadays you can say something about anybody anywhere and it's, you know, on the computer, you could hide behind a screen. You don't get punched in the face. So these kids grow up just being smart asses, you know? Yeah. Or making rude comments. I mean, if you ever read through the comments on the YouTube uh, show, I mean, it's unbelievable. Oh, yeah. People say, I mean, it, it's just bash fest. You know, mm. you guys are in com- constantly delete messages because people feel like their their way of uh telling everybody that they're great is to tell everybody else how bad they are yeah you know? bring everybody down you didn't do that well, back in uh, my days because uh uh good old boy would uh call you out and you'd have to go out in the street and fight them yeah uh it's just like we put that uh, i put that video up this week that uh guy from michigan jake killed those two bucks in one one set up there in michigan it's just like I told him, I said, just be prepared because people are going to say something like they're going to say the bucks are too small or you shouldn't have shot two of them or this or that. And, um, like we get it every, every single video and sure enough, a bunch of people had to downgrade his successful hunt, you know, in their minds. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's just such a big shame. I mean, yeah, in that one short, I talked about, uh, um, shooting a, and I said it was a pretty big buck, you know, about a one forty class eight pointer. And I had uh, uh, a guy just going nuts. If you think a 140 is big, 
you are stupid. You don't know how to hunt. You don't know this. And man, there's some pretty big 140s out there. Right. <laughs> I don't know if that guy knows what a 140 is because, uh, you know, he's telling me he would never shoot something less than 160. Well, he doesn't hunt the public land I hunt then. Maybe right. he's better than I am. He must have like 50 170s on his walls. Yeah. <laughs> but, but uh, uh, you know, you ever see, I was uh, at the Ohio show. I was looking at some of the bucks on the wall. And there were some ungodly looking 140 to 150 inch eight pointers. Yeah. Big I mean, oh my gosh. To, to get 140 or 150 inches on an eight point rack, it's a mm -hmm. pretty big buck. Oh, I mean, yeah. it might not be a big buck on a, a, on a 10 pointer. Maybe it's a nice buck on a 10 pointer. Or, right. Or even a smaller buck on a 12. But an eight frame that scores 140 is a pretty big buck if it yeah. actually nets 140, not what people yeah. call 140. Yeah. An eight point frame could be a 170 pretty quick if it had more points, you know. If you want to watch more videos, there's options here and here. And if you want to subscribe, you can just click right here.